as always. Number one, is this the right move to get out of cyclical tech like chips right now if you're worried about the trajectory of the economy? Well, Scott, I think Steve made the statement that he's a trader, not an investor. And so what we see is that we're looking at the long-term view on semiconductors, and I have several, so I'm looking at the long-term view. So as an investor, I'm still holding these companies and look for positive performance going forward. Yeah, I mean, he would probably say, look, I'm an investor. I'm just a trader when it comes to these stocks because it's dangerous to be an investor in an area that seems suspect, at least at the current time. NVIDIA may be on that list, which reports this week, which you own. You worried? I'm not worried because ultimately what I'm looking at is that NVIDIA's long-term strategy is still on point. You know, they're focused on being a differentiated, broad player. They have exposure to the data centers, gaming, and artificial intelligence. And so and they do this very well. Now, there are some headwinds that we're going to see, but that's only temporary. What about tech in general before I let you run? Uh, the Nasdaq getting really beaten up today, uh, down two and a half percent, a better than 300 point decline. How much worse do you think it gets? Well, we talked about this earlier that it could go down further. But as once again, being a long term, stay true to your strategy and focus on reasonable valuations, which we still see profitability expectations and having a, corp a company that is a good corporate client or a good corporate citizen is what you want to focus on. So stay true to your discipline.